We're here with the team from Southern California. I'm talking to Scott Davis, one of the architects in the project, and he's going to walk us through their project called CHIP. Right. Now, what does that mean? Well, CHIP actually, right now it stands for two things. It stands for Compact House Increasing Possibilities okay. and also Compact Hyper-Insulated Prototype. Hyper-Insulated? Well, right. how, how, how are we hyper-insulated? Well, what we have on the design is an exterior insulation system. Um, it's, it's a bat insulation that wraps around the exterior of the building right outside the OSB. Um, and what that gives us is a continuous quilt that's about 11 inches thick, um, and that gives us very high R values and, and a very tight seal around the envelope. Now, are we fiberglass, cellulose? Uh, well, we actually have a few options. We haven't picked our material yet. Um, we're looking at um, either a, a new stuff that they're making that's a polyester material. Uh, we're also looking at cellulose and also denim batting, which is cotton. Okay, well, talk to me a little bit about the design because it's, it's an unconventional shape. So right. what's going yes, on with that? Yeah. Well, uh, we arrived at the shape by, uh, basically, for the competition, we have to transport the house to Washington, D.C. Right. So uh, we started by looking at the maximum shipping sizes for the different modules. The house breaks up into four different pieces. Um, so we took a solid cube shape uh, that was the maximum shipping sizes, and we took that shape, and we started basically deleting away, cutting away from it um, to make certain moves that would benefit the house. Like, for one, we cut across the southern face to make a large uh, tilted solar roof uh, for the solar panels. And that's right up here? Yeah, that's right up here, yeah. Okay. Um, we also cut across the back on the northern face uh, underneath to uh, create a cantilever, which also helps the uh, interior architectural design. Uh, we have a series of, of levels on the interior that define the program of the house. Uh, so there's basically five different platforms that d define the bedroom, living space, kitchen area, stuff like that. Now is the program of the house, is that architecture speak for the layout? Right, yes, Got yeah, it. the layout, exactly. And it looks like you have a, you're using most of the roof for PV. Is mm -hmm. there any other renewable systems going on in here? Uh, Yes, um, we have the photovoltaics. We also are using a solar thermal system uh, that I can't comment on extensively because I'm um, on the architecture side and we have our, our engineers that are that are running that up. But um, yeah, we have a pretty you know highly uh, designed and uh, refined uh, mechanical system. Uh, and, and and what's the overall square footage? It's just above 800 square feet. So okay. it's, it's meant to be a, a pretty sized down single family home. Great. And are you hoping to stay underneath the budget, or...? Yeah, oh, definitely. If we go over the budget, we lose points, so okay. we want to stay under as much as possible. Okay. Great. Well, look forward to seeing the, the final outcome. All Good right, luck on the you. project. Thank you very much.